welcome first into the red corner, representing TS Kickboxing, Martin Cox. for two big men. Cox walking his man down, but Pryor, like his coach before him, happy on the back foot, happy on the counter. Throwing the shots when he comes back in. Both men has to break the referee now. Just misses again, Cox with the kick. Pryor again, happy on the counter, happy to see what his man's going to do. Just misses with the round, as then spins, lands with the second leg. No real power there, then, but it's a scoring point. Nice loose jab from Pryor, working his way nicely into this first round. Just missed Cox with the uppercut. Both men throw the shots, and the heavy shots from Cox come in there. Good opening round. Second attack. Round two. So an intriguing first round. Two big men, but fast, skillful, and light on their toes. Now Pryor, the one looking to come in, and a big left from Cox. And again. Cox looking to close Pryor down, but so light on his feet. And looking to score his own points now. Pryor, he's got to work though as well. Turns his man, looks to free his hand. Side kick from Pryor as Cox come in, looks for the act but misses. He's got to be careful when he misses with the power of Cox. this second round Pryor's not getting through with so many combination work not as fluent as he was in the first round short right hand though but again moves out like to see more combination work from him like we did in the first Cox the big right hand attempt doesn't land cleanly and away they go again Nice one, two from Pryor. Good stiff left jab from Cox. 
Good stiff left jab again from Cox. The right uppercut just misses. Cox chasing his man. Bit more composure after good work would have benefited him more. He did the good work. Composure after that would have been better for him. Big right hand from Cox. Better round for the man in red for me. And a good finish to the midsection. I've got him one round each after that. Good round from Cox. Wasn't the fluid nature of Pryor here in the second. So I've got it one round apiece. Two very contrasting rounds there. And again, it's Cox looking to back his man up, looking to do the work, but I'd like to see him set it up there. Pryor not as fluent as he was in the first and the second. And Cox trying to work, walk right through him, and big shots from Cox, and a big roundhouse as well, backing his man up. Pryor needs to get back to what he did well in the first round because Cox is bullying him out of this fight. It's a good tactic. Nice short right hand from Pryor. But he needs more. Again, the roundhouse from Cox is the one that lands. And Pryor's not doing the snappy work he did in the first. Big right hand from Cox again. And he is bullying his man out of his rhythm and scoring the points in doing so. Pryor looking to fight on the counter, but he's got to work when he turns his man. It's not enough just to turn him. He's not getting the points in. And again, a good body shot from Cox and a strong left hand. Pryor needs to do a lot more of that to get back into this fight. Cox the uppercut. And he's the man forcing the pace again here in this third. He's forcing Pryor to work and Pryor isn't working with the snap or the control he had in the opening round. And again the uppercut and the big right from Cox. And for me I'm just going to edge to the red again in this round. So on my card which is only unofficial I've got red two rounds to one. We shall see. And ladies and gentlemen, our referee is just said to me for two big men, what skill, what speed, what a great man. Our two fighters have split the decision, the decision. it's a majority decision, in favour of the red corner, Martin.